Hello guys, uh, just giving you a review of my version of uh, Pink Eye 12.4. Uh, just going to show you what this version is about, uh, what I've done, what I've changed. Um, obviously, a lot of things, as you can see right off the top, but completely different. Uh, the wallpaper, you got conky, a different type of conky. Uh, the ordinary uh, docky is gone. Um, tons of extra. Uh, icons, themes, uh, we'll just go through a couple of the things really quick but just want to just give you a quick overview of what I've done um, as you can see it loaded up uh, tons of uh, extra software uh, the ordinary uh, ping guys 1.7 gigabytes uh, my version is just a little bit over 2.4 um, but a lot of the stuff is under the hood I'll show you guys how to work it and what to do with it um, but I think it's an overall fantastic uh, uh, OS uh, that Pink Eye has made, but uh, I just tweaked out a bit, made it easier for you guys to do uh, a bit more modification. Um, let me just show you guys what it looks like this, and I'll show you how easy it's to tweak and do. I've loaded up GNOME Tweak and uh, Ubuntu Tweak. On this version, I highly recommend using the GNOME Tweak. Alright guys, going to show you how you uh, tweak uh, my OS, uh, the Ping Guy OS. Uh, uh, very simple, with event settings, the GNOME Tweak tool. Um, just quick things really quick, if you guys don't like the icons um, up there, you just want a simple straightforward, you can just take them out like that very simple and come they come back right up um, so it's that simple to get rid of the icons I've had a lot of questions how do you get rid of the icons etc so there's the easiest way that I know of um, let's go to the themes really quick because this is where you guys have a lot of the stuff um, here we go got plenty of uh, window themes here so have a look at that just uh, just tons to uh, check out. Plenty of cool ones. Look at that. Nice. Alright. I'll just put it back to the Mac one where we had it at. And, uh, pretty simple. Now let's go to uh, icon themes. Plenty of icon themes on this. You want to have a Mac look. Uh, change it to a Mac look. Very simple. Cool themes. These are the themes that come by default, but as you can see, tons of tons of uh, icons um, available on this OS. The next thing is uh, GTK theme. Um, this is uh, the inside, the box, the inside of what you can do. Uh, let's have a look at what we can do. See that we could change everything, um, and there's plenty of other themes. There you are. Have a look at that. Just leave it there. Uh, this theme, um, the shell theme, this is the very top uh, theme. So let's have a look at what we could do. We could go darker up there, we could go lighter, we could go hybrid, frosty, a couple other things. So let's go the dark one. See that how that's changed? Fusion, there you go. Uh, let's go to Optimus Blue. Very cool, this. You see that? Let's uh, have, open up the window. Everything's very nice. Have a look at that. All right, let's move on from uh, the GOM uh, tweak tool the, on the, under event settings. Uh, now let's look at Ubuntu tweak. This is really good for uh, the other environments. So this is just telling you my specs of what I have on the system. There's uh, some tweak tools, your sounds, your configuration. You see how this doesn't have everything the other one does. The other one's a lot easier to use, so my recommendation for uh, the GNOME environment, you want to stick with the GNOME advanced settings tweak tool, so that's my recommendations for you. A um, couple of other stuff. One thing I do love is uh, the computer janitor on Ubuntu Tweak, which is, works very good and easily clean. Uh, I should do it every uh, third day or something like that. Keep your computer run to maximum performance. All right. Uh, next thing I want to show you guys is this little uh, tool that I've added on. Um, 
Pink Eye added his own one. Um, I just think this one works a lot easier. Um, you can load up your wallpapers. Uh, I've loaded up a hundred, over a hundred and something wallpapers in there, so um, you guys could change them all around. Um, as you can see, plenty of beautiful wallpapers there. Just choose what you want. You can ch change the times of uh, what you uh, want right there. Change wallpaper in random time, two to twenty minutes. Uh, change wallpaper, choose randomly. So take a screenshot. Uh, just a lot of stuff you could do. So there's another thing. Um, so I hope you guys like this distro and uh, if you have any questions of tweaking anything just give me a buzz uh, or just give me uh, just send me a comment below and we'll try to sort it out for you. Thanks guys. Bye.